subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi, welcome to Test Prep Training. Today we will discuss about, Exam 70 to 764, Administering ASQL Database Infrastructure. Administering ASQL Database Infrastructure 70 to 764 is designed for those, who want to become ASQL Server Administrator. After this exam, professionals who administer, and maintain SQL Server databases, and who develop applications that deliver content from SQL Server databases will gain the knowledge, and skills to administer ASQL Server Database Infrastructure. Who can take this exam? This exam is intended for database professionals who perform installation, maintenance, and configuration tasks. Other responsibilities include, setting up database systems, making sure those systems operate efficiently, and regularly storing, backing up, and securing data from unauthorized access. Now we will discuss about, learning objectives. Microsoft provides a learning path for administering a SQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam, which is specifically designed for the candidates, who are seeking to build a career as Microsoft Certified Solutions Associate, SQL 2016 Database Administration. The objectives for 70 to 764 exam are as follows. First, configure data access, and auditing, 20 to 25 percent. Second, manage backup, and restore of databases, 20 to 25 percent. Third, manage, and monitor SQL Server instances, 35 to 40 percent. Fourth, manage high availability, and disaster recovery, 20 to 25 percent. Learning Path Microsoft provides various certifications in several fields. However, administering a SQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam, and provisioning SQL databases 70 to 765 are paths to become MCSA, SQL 2016 database administration. Exam details. Explaining the format of administering a SQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam is the most important step. The exam includes 40 to 60 number of questions. The questions will appear in the form of multiple choice. The candidate will get 120 minutes to complete the exam. In total, they get 150 minutes. The exam is available in various languages such as English, Japanese, Chinese, Korean. The candidate has to pay 165 US dollars as the examination fee. Now we will talk about scheduling the exam. In order to appear in Microsoft exam, the candidate has to schedule the exam and make themselves register with Microsoft. The candidate can schedule their exam with the Pearson VUE. Detailed course outline. The administering ASQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam includes its objectives and subtopics in it. The detailed course outline is mentioned below. First, configure data access and auditing which compromises 20 to 25 percent weightage for this exam. Second, manage backup and restore of databases, which compromises 20 to 25 percent weightage for this exam. Third, manage and monitor SQL server instances, which compromises 35 to 40 percent weightage for this exam. Fourth, manage high availability and disaster recovery, which compromises 20 to 25 percent weightage for this exam. Let us now discuss about course outline topics in detail. First, configure data access and auditing, 20 to 25 percent. It contains three subtopics which are 1. Configure encryption 2. Configure data access and permissions 3. Configure auditing 2nd. Manage backup and restore of databases, 20 to 25 percent. It contains three subtopics which are 1. Develop a backup strategy. 2. Restore databases. 3. Manage database integrity. 3rd. Manage and monitor SQL Server instances, 35 to 40 percent. It contains five subtopics which are 1. Monitor database activity. 2. Monitor queries. 3. Manage indexes. 4. Manage statistics. 5. Monitor SQL Server instances. Fourth, manage high availability and disaster recovery, 20 to 25 percent. It contains three subtopics which are 1. Implement log shipping. 2. Implement always on availability groups. 3. Implement failover cluster instances. Exam policies. While preparing for Microsoft exam, 
the candidate should visit the Microsoft official site, and refer to the Microsoft exam policies, and try to understand them. The Microsoft policies provide information regarding basic information such as, policies about retaking the exam, scheduling the exam, candidate appeal process, etc. Step-by-step -step preparation guide. Here is a step-by-step -step preparation guide for successfully passing the administering ASQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam. First, Microsoft Learning Platform. Microsoft offers various learning paths, the candidate should visit the official website of Microsoft. The candidate can find every possible information on the official site. For this exam, the candidate will find many learning paths, and documentations. Finding the relatable content on the Microsoft website is quite an easy task. Second, Microsoft Documentation. Documentations are an important learning resource, while preparing for administering ASQL database infrastructure 70 to 764. The candidate will find documentation on every topic relating to the particular exam. This step is very valuable in preparing for implementing an Azure Data Solution exam. Third, Microsoft Online Training and Instructor Led Training. Microsoft also offers online training for many certifications. For administering ASQL database infrastructure 70 to 764 exam, there are some online training courses available which are as follows. 1. Securing data in Azure and SQL Server. 2. Recovering data in Azure and SQL Server. 3. Managing SQL Server operations. The training programs that the Microsoft provide itself is available on their website. The instructor-led training is an essential resource, in order to prepare for the exam like 70 to 764. The candidate can find the instructor-led training on the page of the particular exam on the Microsoft website. Fourth, join a study group, and practice test. For passing the exam like administering a SQL database infrastructure, 70 to 764, the candidate needs to get and share knowledge. So, we are suggesting you join some study where you can discuss the concepts with the people who have the same goal. This will lead the candidate throughout their preparation. The most important step, is to try your hands on the practice test. Practice tests are the one which ensures the candidate about their preparation. There are many practice tests are available on the internet nowadays, the candidate can choose whichever they want. The practice test is very beneficial in preparing the exam like 70 to 764. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.